<laughs> Hi friends, I'm your old pal Papa Dale here once again. Now I'm a retired pastor, teacher, theologian, and professor with over 50 years of service to the Lord Jesus Christ. My name is Dale Warren. Professionally, I'm known in my writing and teaching as D.A. Warren, but my friends just call me Papa Dale, and so that's what you can call me. You can see the details of my personal testimony, family, education, and ministry experience on other videos on this YouTube channel. But for now, let's get right into today's topic, which is, this is the program intro for the Jan Hus Institute of Christian Education. This video is about the comprehensive Jan Hus Institute educational program. The Jan Hus Institute motto is, all truth is God's truth, and all truth is objective. The JHI highest values are honor, integrity, and authenticity. The Jan Hus Institute educational system is a cost-free, four-tiered program that results in a Bachelor of Arts and Literature, BA, a Bachelor of Theology, THB, a Master of Theology, THM, and a Doctor of Theology, THD. Now, these prog programs are rigorous, intensive, and they build upon each other so that earning the BA is prerequisite to, earn it, to entry into the THB program. And earning the THB is prerequisite, prerequisite to entry into the THM program. And earning the THM is prerequisite to entry into the THD program. Now, you may not wish to complete all four tiers. You may decide to do only the BA or the THB program. This is, this is fine. This is going to be a great, a great education for you. But to complete the entire program, you must follow the order indicated. Now, here's a summary of what you're going to learn. The completion of the four-tiered program requires a minimum of a thousand plus lectures, hundreds of hours of reading, hundreds of hours of original research, 400 pages of original writing, hundreds of hours of practicum, a written practicum report, Bible verse memorization, reading the Bible through eight times in eight different translations, and successful completion of one midterm and one final exam for each tier, BA, THB, THM, and THD. Well, not just anyone is allowed to enter into this program. Prerequisites for admission are 1. You must be born again, John 3.3. 3. 2. You must sincerely, deeply, dynamically believe and eternally commit to the Lord Jesus Christ as personal Savior, Acts 16.31 that his work alone is salvific, Ephesians 2, 8, and 9, that he lived and died in your place to pay for your sins, was buried, physically rose from death on the third day, and was seen by his followers, 1 Corinthians 15, 1 through 5. You must commit to becoming more like him, and you must be working towards that, 2 Peter three eighteen. And three, you must regularly either attend a local Bible-believing church or attend the online Cornerstone Calvary Chapel Church, and the link is in the notes, or a conservative doctrinally equivalent evangelical church. Now, this is according to the instruction of Hebrews 10.25. Four, you must become involved in a regular ministry practicum, ministry in the church, street witnessing, visitations in prison, shut-ins or nursing homes, music ministry, 
or online, blogging, videoing, teaching, etc. This is according to the Great Commission of Matthew 28, 19 and 20. Number five, you must be active on some kind of social media platform, posting a minimum of one message each day about the Christian faith. Six, you must actively pursue a discipling relationship with someone both more mature in the faith than you and someone else less mature in the faith than you. Number seven, you must read the history of our namesake, Jan Hus, and the link for that is in the lesson notes. Accreditation. This Christian education is self-supervised. As an evangelical Christian education, it is not accredited by any secular institution. It is accredited only by Yahweh. Acts 4.13, John 6.45, Isaiah 54.19, Acts 5.29, 2 Timothy 2.15. The value of an education is not found in the degree letters behind an individual's name. The value is found only in the seriousness with which the student applies him or herself to actually learn. Completion. Successful completion of the following allows you to claim to hold up to the two bachelor's, one master, and one doctoral degrees from, J from JHI. For each degree within each grouping of lectures, you'll see BA, THB, THM, and THD, you must Download each lecture to your computer or other device or thumb drive as a permanent PDF. Read the Bible through two times in a different translation each time as directed. Watch each lecture two times. Read the lecture notes for each lecture. Look up each Bible citation. Memorize. 25 Bible citations per degree program. Take your own notes for each lecture. Write a 250-word summary for each lecture for your own files. That's not required for Bible Shorts or Bible Quicks. Write out your personal testimony of at least 500 words. Make a video of you reading it and post it on the social media platform. Pass the midterm and final exam for each degree division. And then for advanced degrees, THM students must select two topics from a list provided for two theses of 2,500 words each from lectures and outside evangelical sources. THD students must select an additional four topics from a list provided for four theses of 5,000 words each from lectures and outside evangelical sources. Now remember, your Christian integrity is on the line. No shortcuts. This is between you and the Lord Jesus Christ. So, what is the JHI Bible reading requirement? You are required to read through the whole Bible twice for the BA in Biblical Literature degree, to begin each Bible book lecture on specific Bible book titles, read that book first in the Living Bible Translation, then watch the lecture, take your own notes, Read the class lecture notes, watch the lecture a second time, and lastly, read that book again in the New Living Translation. So what I mean by that, in the uh, Bachelor of Arts in Biblical Literature program, uh, part of that is uh, going through every book in the Bible uh, in, uh, in a lecture format. And so... Uh, you know, as you're considering reading each book, you need to first start off 
reading that book all the way through in the in the uh, Living Bible Translation, and then watching the lecture, and then uh, reading that book again in the New Living Translation, and so forth. And that uh, that's how the Bible reading interfaces with the lectures from the BA program. Now, for the THB program, the translations are to be read are first the New International Version, then the New King James Version. And for the Bible readings for the THB, THM, and THD degrees, it's a little more freestyle since there aren't lectures on specific Bible books. So you just include those readings twice as you're pursuing the completion of that degree program. Now for the THM degree, the translations to be read are first the New American Standard Bible, then the English Standard Version. And for the THD degree, the translations to be read are first the Amplified Bible, then the Interlinear Septuagint. Now, all versions are currently available free of charge on BibleGateway.com's platform, except the Septuagint, which is available, and there is a link to that in the Bible notes. Now, I recommend that you download these eight translations to thumb drives so you have a permanent record of them. During the tribulation, or later during the millennium, it may become more challenging to locate the various translations. At that time, and only if necessary, you may substitute any available translation for the, for the one that is instructed, but the reading must still be two times through for each degree. JHI Ministry Approvals Completion of the BA program also automatically awards the student the JHI Diploma to Teach. This is approval to teach Bible classes through the junior high school level. Completion of the THB program also awards the student the JHI Certificate of Ministry Approval. This is approval to teach the principles of the Evangelical Christian Church to all people. Completion of the THM program also awards the student the JHI License to Minister. This is approval to teach, conduct baptisms, dedicate babies, lead in communion, and perform marriages. Completion of the THD program and the work listed below awards the student the JHI full ordination approval. This is approval to lead as a senior pastor and to perform any ministry of the Evangelical Christian Church. Please note, JHI issues approvals, not paper diplomas. If you want to have your own paper diploma that you can hang on your office wall or have for your records, then you have our permission to uh, make one on your own and uh, to use it and to have it. So additional ordination requirements. Read the three articles linked here concerning the inerrancy of, of Scripture. And the first one is from gotquestions.org. Uh, the second is from Wikipedia Encyclopedia. And the third one is to read and agree to the actual Chicago Statement on Biblical Inerrancy, printed by the Gospel Coalition and appears here at the gospelcoalition.org. Now, I recommend that you download those to thumb drives as well. Also, then, you must read and affirm that you are compliant with the biblical qualifications for ministry, according to both 
1 Timothy 3, 1 through 13, and Titus 1, 5 through 16. Fifth, you must create a personal list of the top 40 Christian doctrines with explanations. Sixth, you must create a personal list of preferred research resources. And seventh, the final act is to affirm before the Lord, once you've completed all of that for your ordination, the final act is to affirm before the Lord and two believer witnesses in prayer that you are committed to his service, to preach his truth, and to edify the Christian community. This prayer seals your commitment to him and confirms your ordination. When all of these things have become, been completed, add your name to the list in the comment section below the last lecture for each degree program. Also note there, when you've completed the JHI ministry ordination requirements, you may communicate directly with me by direct message on Facebook at Dale Warren. Signed, Papa Dale, 2024. In Jesus' name. Ha, 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 ha.